Hey everyone, welcome. I'm Naomi, and you might not know this about me, but one of my big missions in life is to make movement easier for everyone, right? I just want to make it easier for you to move your body every single day. So what I'm sharing with you today are three two-pose flows. Two-pose flows. So all that really means is that in each flow sequence, there are only two poses that you're doing, and you flow through them from one side to the other, and you get your movement in really quickly. And at the same time, it feels really good and really seamless. And so hopefully this will make it easier for you to just get up and move any time that you are feeling a little tight, a little bit stuck, or you just want to give your body a little bit of movement to have more energy or to just feel better in your body. So let's meet our two pose flows. You're going to start taking a wide stance on your mat, toes point out. You need to start in a squat, okay? And then left forearm to left thigh, sweep your right arm alongside your ear. Come on back into your squat, right forearm to right thigh, left arm alongside your ear, and your left leg straightens. Back to your squat, right arm alongside your ear, straighten your left leg. Back through that wide squat to the right, left arm alongside your ear. And just keep going from side to side. Just a few more times. Side to side from your squat and reach, squat and reach. Okay? And one more time to each side. And then come on back to center. So flow number one, you go from a squat into a side body stretch. Okay, flow number two, flow number two is you're going to go from a reverse warrior into triangle pose. So wide stance on your mat, bend your right knee. So this is warrior two, and then reach back. Left hand to left leg, reverse warrior. And now straighten your right leg, turn right foot and left foot out. Now you're in triangle on the other side. Okay, then lift all the way up, bend your left knee, reach it back, reverse warrior. And then straighten your left leg, turn left foot in, triangle pose to the right. Now in your triangle pose, you can take your hand anywhere you want, so it can be supported on your leg or all the way to the floor, but come on back up, bend your right knee, reverse it, warrior. And then straighten your right leg, turn right foot in, left foot out, triangle pose. Come all the way up, bend your left knee, reverse warrior. Straighten your left leg, turn left foot in, right foot out, triangle. Okay, and one more time at each side. So come all the way up, bend your right knee, reverse warrior. Straighten your right leg, turn your right foot in, left foot out, triangle pose. Last one, all the way up, bend your left knee, reverse warrior. And then straighten your left leg, turn your left foot in, right foot out. Triangle pose. You come all the way back up. Give your body a little shake because that was your two pose flow number two, which is a reverse warrior into triangle pose on the other side. And that's how it moves. You ready for your last two pose flow? So turn your left foot out, right foot in, warrior two. Okay, now turn towards your right leg and lift up warrior three. Bend your right knee, step left leg back. Warrior two, and then turn your right foot in, reach as you lift your right leg up, warrior three. <laughs> Bend your left knee, step back, warrior two, and then sweep towards your right leg and lift up, warrior three. Bend your right knee, step back, warrior two. Turn towards your left leg, bend your left knee, push off, warrior three. Step your right leg back, warrior two. And then turn towards your right leg, lift off, warrior three. Step your left leg back, warrior two. Turn your right leg in, lift off, woo, warrior three. Okay, one more time each side, step right leg back, warrior two. Turn your left foot in, push off, warrior three. Last one, step your left leg back, warrior two. And then turn your right leg in, push off, Warrior three. And then put your right foot down. Whew, give yourself a little shake. And that third two pose flow is a warrior two and reversing to the other side into warrior three. And then going back and forth in that way. So 
That's it. Those are three two-pose flows that you can do anytime you need a little extra movement. And hopefully, knowing these two-pose flows will not only give you the tools that you need to move your body a little bit more when you just need to get moving, but also maybe inspire you to create your own two-pose flows. So, thanks for hanging out with me on the mat today. I hope you enjoyed this. See you back again next time. Until then, bye everyone.